plates or cutters here at DoSpace are capable of two types of engraving, vector engraving and raster engraving. Today I'm going to talk about how to prep images for raster engraving. We've found that having an image that is black and white and has a high contrast is necessary to get the best results out of our engraving on the laser cutter. There's a bunch of different ways that you can do this, but I've found that the easiest way by far is to go to a website. I'm going to type in pixlr.com. Hit enter. And I'm going to upload my image to this website, edit it, download it, and it will be ready for use on the laser cutter. So I'm going to click. Actually, the first thing I'm going to do is going to switch to Pixel R E. That's the editor. This is a free website. It is sponsored by ads, so you will periodically see ads pop up. I'm going to hit open image. Find the image that I want to use. It's on my desktop. So this is an image of friends. So I'm actually going to bring in, in on the original size, but I'm going to crop it down because it's eventually going to fit onto a square coaster. So let's crop it. This is the crop tool. Let's crop it so it's a little more square. All right, and I'm going to click apply. And then I'm going to come up to adjustments. I'm going to auto black and white. And then adjustments again. And I'm going to come down here to levels. And with levels, there are a couple of different sliders. There's a dark slider, a light slider. I'm going to move this out of the way a little bit so I can see my image as I go. And I'm going to push the dark slider so I've got really good dark darks. And I'm going to push my white slider so I've got really good light lights. And I want the image to be slightly overblown, which means that the whites are really bright and the darks are really dark. Let's lighten that up a little bit. And I'm going to go ahead and hit apply. And now my image looks like this. And I'm going to click file and save. I'm going to save it as a JPEG in high format. And I'm going to click download. This will download it to my computer. And it's ready for me to bring into the laser cutter software and cut it and engrave it with the laser cutter.